The Holy Tales. Hello, friends. We are back. Aren't you excited to meet Holy? She is going to tell us a new story from the Bible. Yes, yes, we are. Let's go to Holy. Welcome, kids. I have already decided which story to tell you today. So, are you all ready? So, today's story is about the woman at the well. One day, Jesus and his disciples were walking to Galilee and they went through a place called Samaria. Jesus was tired of walking for so long, so he sat near a well to rest while his disciples went to search for food. A woman came to the well to get water and Jesus asked her for some water to drink. The woman was surprised to see Jesus speaking to her because in those days, the Jews thought that they were much superior to the Samaritans. They considered the people of Samaria to be lowly to them and therefore had nothing to do with them. The woman asked Jesus, You are a Jew and I am a Samaritan. Why are you asking me for water? If you knew who I really am, you would be asking me for living water. Jesus said, But you don't have a rope or a bucket. The woman said, This is a very deep well. How are you going to get water? Besides, do you think your water is better than the water in this well that our ancestor Jacob dug? People get thirsty again after they drink this water. Jesus said, But the water I give takes away thirst altogether. They will never be thirsty again. Please give me some of that water, the woman said. Then I'll never have to come to this well again. Okay, go get your husband, Jesus said. I don't have a husband, the woman answered. That's right, Jesus said. But you have had five husbands, and the man you are with right now is not your husband. You must be a prophet, the woman said. So tell me why you Jews insist that we worship in Jerusalem, but we think it is okay to worship here where our ancestors worshipped. The time is coming when it won't matter where you worship, Jesus said. God is looking for those who will worship Him in spirit and in truth. I don't know what you are talking about, the woman said. When the Messiah comes, then all this religious talk will make sense. I am the Messiah, Jesus said. Just then, His disciples returned with the food. They were surprised to see him talking with the woman from Samaria. The woman left her water jar right there beside the well and ran into the town. She called to everyone she met. Come with me to the well. The Messiah has come. I know he is the Messiah because he told me everything that I have ever done. That was a great story. Loved it, Holy? Yes, me too. Good. Now it's time for the question. Where was Jesus and his disciples heading to? They were all walking to Galilee. That's correct. We'll be back soon. Keep watching. To watch more videos, please subscribe. Hidden plants and trees. On the fourth day, God created the sun to shine in the day, the moon and stars to come out at night. One day, Moses went to Mount Horeb with his sheep. There, 
God appeared to him as a flame of fire in a bush. Since there was no room anywhere else, they decided to spend the night in a stable. Here, Mary had her baby, Jesus. She wrapped him in a blanket and put him to sleep. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole.